And let us hope enough yet remains of the world. All right. Oh, you got a disease. Applesauce. You got the oozes still. This miss is fine. Don't worry. Yeah. This this miss is fine. Hey, hey. hey. Death is only temporary. Is it? Well, let's go find out. So how's everybody's weekend going so far? Anybody doing anything fun today? Hey, celiac boy. How's it going? Welcome on in. Oh, God. Four zombos. Just an annoying set of enemies to run into. But we rolled before all of them, so that's great. So that's doing three bleed, yeah. Off the bat, right? Yeah, three bleed. That'll do four bleed. And then when upgraded, this will do four. And that'll do f four. Okay. Hey, Lieutenant Gonzalez. How's it going? Welcome, welcome. Uh, looking after the dog again. He's napping. What kind of doggo? What kind of doggo is it? Did floors. Sprayed the front yard again. Gonna head over to my folks in a few hours. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Birthday for your dad. Yeah. Yeah, get dodged on. You ain't never been dodged so hard in your life. Currently doing a weird build using Ritual Occultist of Malediction. I need to do another attempt at making Malediction work. Especially if we're using, like, the Owl or something. Shroud Gaming for that beautiful 8 bleed. Yeah, if I can get uh, the Leviathan's Trophy, I'll take it. But there's also the new Leviathan's Trophy. So that's pretty interesting. Um, that could be a lot of fun as well. So, yeah, from off, how's it going? Welcome on in. Uh, so it's spelled in a quarter Chihuahua and another quarter Dash Hound. The Blee Trophy is still in the game, yes. The one that they replaced was Lashing Tides, I believe it was called, which was the, uh, the Torch Trophy. The Torch Trophy was the one they removed and sure switched that? out. There is so much work which is the one that needed to be removed and switched out. The Bleed one was fine. Bleed one was actually pretty good. They changed the uh, the torch one to be one that increases stacking of combat items to two. The roaring heart does much for yeah. the weary body. They, I think they've patched it now, yeah. So no more Infernal. Infernal has been removed uh, as of this patch, it seems. Uh, okay. Um, healing received from skills per medical gear equipped. We do have some medical items. So we could do like a heal build. Uh, they removed Infernal Torch. It's temporary. They, they're talking about fixing, like they're changing Torch and how Torch works, so they want to change how Infernal works, so. If your comp has uh, bleed only on a cultist heal, yeah. It's fun fighting the equivalent of a god to earn a glorified lamp. Yeah. I got a nice, look at my torch. It's so torchy. It's the torchiest. Um... I would use this if we were doing the, um, like doing a, not the bleed jester and we were doing a moving jester, but what croc does? Yeah, it does additional damage every time you move and then it has a, a low chance to reduce your speed. Um, this one's probably going to be what we go for. See how, uh, only plus 5% healing received per medical gear item equipped. So this one would do 25% healing. Um, and the other medical one we get would also increase us by a little bit. Could probably make it, like, if you get it up high enough, right? If you get all four medical gear equipment, that's 20% healing from that. 20% healing from that, and then whatever else you have. Like, if you get Kyrogen's table, that's disease resist as well, or disease removal. Um, best choice, because all you have is weird, yeah. We will want the healing right now. The crocodile will, will make work sometime. It's a it's a fun pet, but uh, we'll do we'll do the pliskin for now. Get that get that pliskin and get that medical equipment going. And uh, let's see what else we got. Raven's Reach will be a good start for us. <laughs> oh, where are we going? We might be able to get some. The provinces and camp tribes of our land. I'm kind of tempted to take this almanac for the shroud, uh, even though it's expensive, 
and say screw the rest of this stuff so that way when we do go to the shroud which i'm planning on doing so i want to make my jester a bleedy boy um we can just we can just mow through stuff so i'm gonna take that it's kind of useless right now but your coach must be maintained if it is to carry you where you must go i like that little hissing noise the um and this is going to be called the uh sneaky snack the sneaky snack. It's a sneaky snack. Uh, and it's poisoned. There we go. So. Alright. Oh, we only get two mastery points now. God, I'm so used to five mastery points in the last two runs. Alright. So where are we gonna go? Probably not gonna get that. More resistance encounters. Keep the flame at 40 or higher. I mean, that's going to be a little hard to do. More hoarder locations, though. Um, showed another stream the other day. You can name the pets, and his reaction was priceless. Yes, we actually have a channel point redeem for renaming a pet. No, no, just for uh, the five chat. The five mastery points is only on the shorter denial act, Gonzalez. If you're on the regular, like resentment and obsession, or both the regular length, you only get the two. For 20k, it's expensive. All right, it's only only one person can get it per run. Sneaky snake, brother of solid snake. Yeah, I need like what exclamation point kind of thing going on. Uh, we'll go for the tangle. Mud and rain, resignation and death. This land is truly barren. Wow, wow, wow. All right, let's -a go. Not Mario, so Rewards only, only. Resignation. resignation. A lot of rough patches on this one. I'm noticing so assistance encounter will probably go up this way because there's more choices. We don't know what that one is. Um, okay, I leave now. Okay. All right. Going to the right. Ruts in the roadway. There is a barricade ahead. Oh man, I love these new voice lines. So long, second best mod. Oof. Them's fighting words, Pate. Do you have amateur armor smith? You sure do. What else we got? Cosmic Slayer. Steady. Yeah, this this guy ain't moving nowhere. <laughs> Sprain wrist, boisterous. Dancer's balance. That's actually pretty good for us. We'll actually be pretty set for the um pretty good place for the uh Leviathan. Measured and steady. Dude, stop oozing yourself. He got he got he got oozed. New cultist is Cosmic Slayer, yeah. Should also be Cosmic Fearing, because he is pretty terrified of the Shambler. Consider the fact that, like, you know, he summoned him, and it was a whole thing, and... Uh, dead, right? Yeah, so just weaken him. Weaken him, so another may finish the job. Variable. Easily resolved. There we go. We fucked those guys up. They dead. Um, we're not going to use a protectorate charm. I need my occultist to be dealing damage. Oh my god. Guys, I just got an email that British Brad is live. 
Every time my leper dies, one part of me dies. Uh, you might not want to play the leper anymore then, because he's probably going to die a fuck ton. I'm just going to say it. I'm just going to say it outright, okay? Alright, um... Plus 30 flame for some in items, minus 50 flame for many relics. Interesting. Stagecoach items. Stagecoach items could be pretty good for us. I'm tempted to take the stagecoach items. Let's see what we get. Oh, okay. That's road gear. It's not medical gear, but it's it's not bad. It'll help us with the, the wheels and stuff. Is it not? Um, okay, so one has a fight. Where are we? And takes us that way. Again, I think we go to the right. We don't know what the the road encounter is. Oh, it's a rough patch. Okay, that's fine. You guys ready to do some Tokyo drifting? Woo! Keep it steady, damn you! Well, I lost out on additional healing. Honestly, with the healing guy and the wheels at full, like, you can get some crazy, like, road heals, I would imagine. Like, just unkillable if you survive to the road, at least. This is going to hurt two relationships. It's going to help one, but at the cost of 15 torch, which I really don't feel like losing. We can get our relationships back up. That's fine. I just want to fight baddies. I want to, I want to, I want to... Pew 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 pew. Hey, I'm Day. How's it going? Welcome on in. Welcome, welcome. Oh my God, he's got a crit token. All right, just start stacking up that bleed. Drummer boy goes. Mori goes like. Most dedicated minion. Is that a yellow hand highwayman? It is not. It is not yellow hand. It is a sharp shot. It is a boring basic highwayman. But you know what? He gets the job done. He got hit twice. Did he? Is he a braggart or something? No. How did he generate a third? Oh, probably got hit by whatever. Yeah, focus fire, that's it. I was like, what? Six, six, he's dead. He's out of here. Arguably getting the job done is the most valuable. It is. Sometimes the fun Mimi builds are fun, but I gotta get these videos on YouTube, man. I gotta, I gotta satisfy the YouTubers, the YouTube audience. My video yesterday, my like first pet run video, has done the best out of any of my Let's Play videos ever. Like, normally my Let's Play videos get, like, if I'm lucky, they get, like, 800 to 1,000 views in, like, a week. It's been, like, a day, and it's already gotten 2,000 views. Like, oh, yeah. So that's nice. That's a nice feeling, man. Come here, Mr. Drummer. Yeah, you can resist the move resist all you, or the move all you want, but, uh, you're still going to get closer. And I'm still going to slice your head off. Feels viewed, man. Yeah. Feels viewed, man. Bro, I am about to bash the shit out of you. I'm watching you and a 10 hour stream. It's very confusing. There's a lot of things happening on my screen. I don't know what I'm supposed to. Oh, okay. Sure, video game. Yeah. We'll just we'll just get clenching claws from a random fight. The CTR hello. on which video? Hello. Uh, hey, Blood Ninja. How's it going? Hello, hello, hello. hello. On. Holy crap, dude. The one I just posted this morning is already at 112 views. What the fuck is going on? I guess it's a popular time to be looking at Darkest Dungeon videos right now. 
Are you talking about my Redemption Road one? The click-through rate on that is like, uh, it's like 10%, which is pretty good. At least for me. I don't get the best click-through rates on my videos. Um, let's see, where, where would we like to go? Do we take on the lair with this team? I mean, it's it's definitely doable with this team. It's not like... It wouldn't be super happy fun time with this team. I'm not really prepared for it. <clears throat> but I say we'll, we'll go for the... Uh, I gotta be careful here. If I go this way and then that way, which is what I'm thinking I would do, I would... Well, if I go this way, I'm pretty much guaranteed to lose my wheels put your videos on when i'm going to bed i appreciate that that's that's really nice to uh yeah I'm, I'm sorry though for people who do that and then they wake up in the middle of the night to cats screaming at them or like a jump scare it's like oh god i was just trying to sleep man like yeah, i'm sorry dude i'm so sorry what the fuck i i mean i saw the heel is that from Destiny this one will not be denied versus this one because it like actually had like a heel symbol i've never seen that before no i take that as a that's a very night nice, like a very um that's a great compliment people are like oh i was like the people who i put the most hours into that i watch are the people who i put on like when i'm going to bed like there's a binding of isaac streamer or content creator i watch who i just like put his vods on um, I must have given that guy, like, hundreds of hours uh, of my time just by, uh, just by watching his videos and stuff. Like, it's a, it's a huge honor that people, like, like, yeah, that's the thing I want to, like, just chill out and zone out to. Boom! You guys aren't gonna like this. It's gonna hurt. Oh, best stress sealer in the game, baby. Bro, you've got too many negative tokens. For like months, yeah. I did the same thing with like Darkest Dungeon. Like, I used to uh, watch a streamer's like Let's Plays. And, I mean, I probably spent, <laughs> like, a thousand hours watching that person over time. Show off his cool ass anim- Yeah, his animations are fucking dope, dude. We're already off to a really strong start with a Poet Leper that has clenching claws. Like, we're feeling- We're feeling pretty beefy with that. Oh, I don't know. Oh, there it is. Once again, the comrades it's working. are right, and the comrade sits at very the epicenter oh, of karmic unrest. Comrades rally to their twisted idols, and great gongs sound in anticipation of the coming sacrifices. Far below, life-laden comrades pulse to the unrelenting rhythm of a beating comrade. Good morning, comrade. How you doing? I'm glad it works again. I don't know what was causing it to freak out last night. More of these guys! Hi guys! I just killed your friends! I'm about to kill you too! Oh, it's gonna be a good time. Just woke up and ate some cereal. Cereal is a great way to start the day. What kind of cereal though? These actual words for TTS Rabbit just one 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 or yeet. <laughs> Yeet. <laughs> the enemy weakens and wanes. That is still one of my favorite voice lines in the game. I'm really glad they updated that one. Because it used to be a little less, like, potent. It's like, the enemy weakens and wanes. And now it's like, eh, they're weakening. And they're fucking waning. I'm like, all right, we get it, Wayne. Violence and apply it judiciously. Judiciously. Ooh, that's a good word. Malaise. Measured and steady. 
Can we get a heal on our leper? We sure can. Good morning, Kikon. How's it going? We still doing random comps? No, we're not doing random comps today. No, we're trying out new pets and stuff. I like eating cereal for breakfast because I usually wake up to a dry throat and the milk from the cereal makes it not dry. That is that is a good reasoning. I just like cereal because it's a great excuse to eat sugar in the morning. Which I say as I drink my chocolate, hot chocolate with caffeine in it. So yeah, Grape Shot Spam does activate my, my serotonin receptors. I can tell you those Rice Krispies. Cocoa Rice Krispies are a god tier cereal. S tier. S tier cereal chat. I want some hot chocolate. Sage. Sage. I am Le Sage. Waking up with Folgers in your cup. I don't know why that's stuck in my head. Tottenham too. Yeah. Hey, I get it. Football comes first. Oh boy. Look at all this shit. That was, that was, uh, that's some fucking loot, dude. Holy crap. Um, four noisemakers. Why am I not playing Obsession right now? <laughs> Jeez. Trinket organizer. Oh, I never put Raven's Reach on a uh, on my highwayman. Whoops, a Daisy. Good job, BB. Playing the game well, BB. Standard Rice Krispies are good too. Oh god, the other stream has like five people talking. I'm so confused. I I. Look, when chat gets hectic, it's hard to keep up with. Was honeycomb always a good seer? I haven't had a honeycomb in a long time. Ahead, a bestial refuge. Why is causing that heal? And less I don't know if that's the Pliskin that's causing that heal, but it it's weird. Because it's normally a road heal just like moves the bar up. It doesn't have like a animation. Yeah, it's just, I know the, the pet causes a random heal after a location. I'm guessing that's what the heal is. It's the random after location one. Just, I mean, that's the only new thing is the pet, so just interesting. Uh, who hates you the most? Not Swan. We'll get all our relationships down, so that way we're evenly hating each other. Da -na, da -na, da -na, da -na. Oh god, they shuffled us! Oh god, they shuffled us. Wow. Bro, your 80% stun resist is not doing a job right now. I'm just gonna be straight up with you. Every day I'm shuffling. There we go, clenching claws. That's the work I need. Yeah, four four noisemakers was a pretty good find. And clenching claws is just gonna. Also, hi Alex, by the way. Sorry, I didn't say hello. I just kind of was like, oh. respond and don't say anything. There we go. Start stacking that bleed. Uh, let's just remove the dodge here. Is that a Shuff reference? Is that a sh Oh my god. Do you, you think Shuffle purposely picked that name? Because he knew that he was going to get shuffled all the fucking time in Darkest Dungeon? That's got to be it, right? Having a dodge ignore is so underrated. It does. It is a, an ability that I kind of forget is in his kit sometimes. And then I'm like, oh god, he has this. And it just removes all of the dodge. You don't need dodge where we're going. Okay. That's pretty good. Uh, I'll just go ahead and reflection here. Because if I kill him, they're all going to come in. They're all going to get turned. So we want to kill him uh, basically first thing here if we can. And then we get a set of free actions. Name after the shoved up because it'll boost his name in the algorithm. Yeah. Make a spider bleed. I'm pretty sure they don't have blood. Um, don't. I don't. I, I don't fucking know. You think I know? 
What the kind of I don't, okay? I have no idea. Haste and carelessness. All marks of the unprepared. That was not haste or carelessness. That was an, uh, a tactical application of token removal abilities. Do spiders not have blood? I don't know how bugs work, man. How do fucking bugs work? They have, like, juice inside them, right? They've got juice. Oh my god, dude. That 80% stun is, like, absolutely not doing its job. At least the positive is here that he's spreading the love a little bit, so... What's the point redeemed to drink spider juice? I would rather jump off a cliff. The new Cappy Gandhi party. I find that bug to this day to be one of the funniest things in, in gaming history. The Gandhi glitch in Civ, like that shit <laughs> is so funny. Around your violence and apply it judiciously. I don't want to apply it judiciously. I want them to die. Another impediment. Without a jury of their peers. It's gamer spider <laughs> It's gamer bathwater. What's the rest of that fact? <laughs> you just to an air compr <laughs> <laughs> Did the spider get you? Necessary. Why? Why would they hook a dead spider up to an air compressor? What does that... What purpose does that serve, furry? Please, inform me. Enlighten me. I'm confused and I am scared. The flame sputters. You must give hope. Oh, here we go. Fun fact of the day. Spiders, like most anthropods, have an open circulatory system, i.e. they do not have true blood or veins which transport it. Rather, their bodies are filled with a hemolyph which is pumped through the arteries by a heart into spaces called sinuses surrounding their internal organs. There you go. Fun fact. Use it like a claw machine to grow. Why? That is not a that is not a copy pasta. It's not. Ah yes, thank you, Red Hook, for the. Uh, we made it so that it's very rare that nobody wants torch. Doesn't want torch. Doesn't want torch. Not only do they not want torch, they disagree about not wanting the torch. <laughs> this sucks. Fortune in memories long forgotten. I got some money. It is now, baby. All right, we're about to hit another rough patch. Oh, God. We're out of wheels. We might have urgent repair fight. Urgent repairs. Woo! Coach limping. Be prudent. Uh, did Wayne June just tell me to be a prude? Sorry, Wayne, but I'm putting out. Oh my god, like nobody agrees. I just got all this money, I don't want to lose it. Fuck. I grow all my relationships. Mobile suck. No, you're fine. Furry, you don't have to worry about it. You're good. I understand. You're on a delay. How dare you? How dare you watch me, but in a convenient space like your television? The fucking actual audacity? I mean, like, god. Some people, am I right, chat, or am I right? Toad's right. Thank you. Thank you, Bate. See, Bate understands. British bully is bullying the chatters. This British guy is bullying me. The fiend's strength dwindled. 
bully. Look, chat bullies me. I bully chat. This isn't. This isn't. We we get nah, nah, get out, get out of here with that shit. I'm I'm not going nowhere. You can't stop me. You can't get rid of me. Why doesn't anybody want me? <clears throat> Sorry. Unavoidable. Chatty took all my tokens. Up my tokens. Plus 50% damage. Knights are scary on Death Door, dude. Oh, you messed Yo, up. Oh, Blood big Ninja, time. thank you very much for the <laughs> sub and for using your Prime sub, too. Hell yeah, Daddy Bezos doesn't need that money. I do. Now, thank you very much. I appreciate it. It's very kind of you. I appreciate all the support, everybody. It's been, been a crazy fun couple weeks. I'm excited. We've got some cool stuff coming up with the channel. I'm excited to be streaming some Black Reliquary when that comes out. Excited to be streaming this when it comes out. It's going to be fun. It's going to be a good time. All right. Overall, pretty good first region. We got a lot of good trinkets out of that. Trinket organizer as well, which is good. Um, all in all, feeling pretty, pretty, pretty decent. Pretty decent about this. And apply it this is like the fifth time we've heard this voice line. I don't know why we hear that one so much right now. God, Wayne. Say different things. God, so boring. Oh, yeah, those crit tokens are going to hurt. Forget we're on resentment. Come here. Thank you. A breakthrough. Almost got him. The value on clenching claws is just insane when you really like sit back and think about it. If you get it on the right person, it can just absolutely melt like tokens and stuff. Good dodge, thank you. Good hit. Great hit. So close. And then there were two. I always think they're little helmets, like the tentacles that like come in, like or that. It's like they got little mustache helmets. Look at that, look at that little mustache helmets. How cute. I do like appliances of harms that are both methodical and deliberate. Oh, yeah, I gotta be careful with missing abilities on him, don't I? I only have two people who can hit the front row right now, and neither of them has, like, a particularly strong attack. I mean, besides Grape Shot Blast just being decently goaded right now. Might want to think about adding, switching out an ability or something 
on either my Jester or something. Something that I can hit the front row with if I need to. Like Sack Stab may be a good call instead of uh, one of the curses. Can Sack Stab go from rank four? It can't, my bad. Dude, now we're ending up in this situation where I don't, I don't have the ability to deal enough damage to this guy. Bull curses. The Knights of Curses did just a modicum of damage. Like one. Yeah, we're gonna need to switch out. I can foresee this becoming a problem. <laughs> yeah, it might, it might be worth something like that. Just for that that situation where it comes up, right? Until the next test Hello. For you. Now this is something I would feel pretty good about putting on my leper. Right? Because A, giving him bleed resist is big, and B, giving him max health is great, especially because he's tanking so much. But I don't know if it's better than clenching claws for what we're going for. And everybody else is a damage build. Like, I could put it on the occultist, but, like, not much point. I'll probably keep the, uh, the bleed resist and then leave misstep. If I hadn't found Clenching Claws there and Bugle, I probably would I would have definitely gone for that, but But you Shambler baby? No, we haven't we haven't um found him in the, the inn yet, unfortunately. Uh... It looks really broken. It is if you can make it work. You have to you you have to get the cultist trinkets. <laughs> And consider the fact that they changed it so that cultist uh, nodes are much rarer in region one. And just generally cultist trinkets don't always drop from cultist fights. Like you have to get lucky with it. Got all the worst trinkets, yeah. Lower your guard. Soften your gaze. Late game trinket. Yeah, it's definitely a it's definitely a trinket that builds up, right? Rain, fire, and rot. Is there no We're going to take the sluice. We want to go to the shroud when we get the opportunity to go. Um, so that's that's what we're kind of aiming for. Six mastery points is great, though. You may stand just a little taller at the end. I'm not going to repair the last one because this will repair one of them for me. Um, the sluice is really dangerous now because of the fact that you, uh, <laughs> you don't get any scouting in the sluice. Also, relationships should be okay ish because of the roaring harf that we have right now so every there's only one that has a risk of actually proccing it's this one so i need to up this one by one if i can yeah i mean it, it, it's it makes sense that it's like such a late game a late game one right like it's made to just be like um you know it's it's made to be this like super powerful one that gets you some crazy crazy builds but you have to like get to that point so i'm gonna take these drums because we're planning on fighting the leviathan so let's just get that now planning and mindfulness i love how we don't have any more we don't have any additional healing gear that we found so we need to keep an eye out for healing gear that's luxury it's luxury it's luxury man i really wish that we'd gotten the um i think it's the the orphan wolf cub that would have given us what we needed there do i have any way of increasing my relationships i don't think i do i don't have anything that'll proc a relationship up unfortunately
You don't need other trinkets to make stained stuff work, so you can actually use... Yeah, you, yeah, it's... I mean, it's rare that it happens, but if you can make it work, it can do some really fun stuff. Hey, Guatemalan Defna, how you doing? So we got the one relationship that is at risk here, right? This is the... Who is it? Furry and Bate have a tw one in four chance of getting a negative relationship, which sucks, but you know what? It'll be fine. We're going to save these items for the Shroud if we can. Um, so at worst, we'll get one negative relationship. It it could be much worse, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna worry about it. We'll get with Stan going. Grape shot blast is always a good one. We're crushing this week, but I did see a pickle Hawaiian shirt on YouTube. Yeah, <laughs> I I had to do the pickle Hawaiian shirt. That was fun. Harvest will actually increase the bleed. Where slice off won't, but it does have the vulnerable, but at least increase the bleed opportunity now. Um. Do, 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 I'm gonna upgrade weird because I get the feeling we're gonna need it sooner rather than later. And. Oh, yeah, we wanted to take a look at abilities, didn't we, and see what, about switching something out. Like, I'd probably switch off Encore for, um, man, the problem is both his abilities move him, but they do hit rank one, which is good. You know what? We'll do this. All damage. We're not using Echoing March much. I mean, there's times that we'll use it. We have Demon's Pulse. We have another way of moving, and this will allow us to just... Hit something in rank one if we need to, and deal with it if it comes up. Um, so I will go ahead and add the the mark to. Oh god, Solus is kind of rare. A little bit maybe. Let me turn off that command. One sec. All right. I figured out how to turn it off now, so that's good. Uh, okay. So this will repair itself. I don't really care about the Almanac. Uh, let's hope that we don't get a negative relationship. We got zero. That's fine by me. So the sluice is really dangerous with the new scouting mechanics. Or the new road mechanics because... You have no idea what you're coming up against, so like I have no way of knowing if I'm gonna get hit a you know, a dangerous road or something. This is swine country. Yep, there's a rough patch already. So there goes our traveling heel right off the bat. Yeah, sluice feels like more scary now with the way it works. Like, it really does feel like you just have no idea what's coming at you. Um, I'll take the blind. The blind is a useful start for us. Let's see if we can get some good trinkets, huh? Yeah, glad we took the blind. I mean, the skeever is a scary enemy for sure. Uh, the occultists will be able to remove those tokens, so let's just go do this. This fluff butt's name is Opie. Ooh, what a cute name. Hi, Opie. Good dodge, thank you. Do skitter. Yep. This is where Echoing March would have been good to have kept. Because he he's gonna Thankfully he has to spit to roast, but. Good resist, thank you. Or bleed, which is nice. Just remove him from the game. A promising development. You can still hit him with a bleed because of the corpse, which is nice, so. Measured and steady. Nice. 
Nice. Oh my god! Hey Rain, how's it going? The game is a lot easier about Skeever, yeah. Ooh, Covert Cloak. Interesting. Um, yeah. The additional... Hey, it's my sound. It is your sound. How you doing, Rain? Bash just sounds like a fun skill name. It is a fun skill name. Just fucking bash the shit out of them. Man, the, this is my first time in the sluice since this update, so it's it's spooky, man, about knowing what's going to get you. I think that's an Oblivion Terror. Yeah, it glitched him. The loathing whispers. I've noticed that it only seems like the Jester seems to interact with that. As far like, Every time I go through it and I have a Jester, only the Jester gets the voice line. The bark. There are rumors these rancorous beasts have some demonic spark of otherworldly intelligence man this is gonna hit three relations i'm not here to not fight i'm sorry god damn that would have done honestly i probably shouldn't have done that our relationships are in the fucking gutter right now but bro i need the fights i'm here for shit i'm not here for not shit you know i need my shit not my not shit that makes sense I haven't seen any of the other barks because I always I just been with a jester most of the time and it always seems to pick the jester for whatever reason. Ruin your life, but that could just be me projecting. Probably. It's probably going to ruin my life, but you know what? This game ruins my life anyway, Alice, so... It's all good. It's going to happen anyway. Might as well... Bra uh, six and nine. <laughs> nice. Lethality writ large. Well, that flame is... The flame is... Li yeah, like... She doesn't like it because it's not like her regular flames. Or guess it's over, huh? Oh, game over. It's game over, man. Game over. Yeah, I'll be fine. Get out of here, swine brute. Get out of here, little dude. I always forget what these guys are called. Uh, skulkers. That's what they're called. Leper pointing is so funny. Fucking, you're, you're, you're gonna die today. Hey, exactly. How's it going? Welcome on in. It's good to see ya. in our path in this weighty gloom a spark um well I mean this is good uh I don't think I don't think this is better than what we have like it's just a rare occurrence uh Poet Leopard, yeah. Hammer, hey, how's it going? Just got here? Welcome on in. Good to have you here. We'll take it. It's good. It's a good skill to have. Like, he doesn't get it too often, but, you know, it's still nice to have. Sag for lore reasons, yeah. The loathing abates. Going good. I'm still tired, but just kind of... Uh, kids just don't let you sleep. Yeah. Whoa! The rocks! That's a pretty cool one. I haven't seen that one before. Oh, look, my favorite, an academic study. Uh, oh, they I love how they've, like, made it so you can actually see the full thing now. Everybody wants to touch it. Touch it. Everybody touch it. Bad humors. Bad humors is, like, the least worrisome disease. It is ours now. It's like, oh, I've got some... I don't have disease. The res I what? It's like, doesn't matter. <laughs> like, 
Unless you're using a gilded mine, it doesn't make anything. Oh, that, again, unknown, so we just go. Fuck it, we ball. It's an oblivion. It's a terror. I could see it, like, glitch, like, in the distance. I probably should report that bug. Please, everybody, want to fight? God damn it. Why do you guys want to leave all the time? You're going to ruin my relationships. Doesn't matter. Either way, it's going to hurt the relationships. Fuck it. <laughs> Two of them should skitter, hopefully. Or not. Nope. Damn it. Is he just resisting? It must just be. What's the disease resist? Or the debuff resist? It's only 10%. Weird. Well, we're missing one and hitting one is like giving us some stress and taking away the rest, so. Ah, yes. Double stealth. Double stealth. Um, whatever. I love it when this happens. It's, it's so fun and fair. At least we can hit one of them. Come on. Neither of those proc to stress heal. Come on, game. Bonnie would save us here. Yeah, she would. Bonnie Bonnie would be the, the goat right now. Great Robber the Runs, the Warriors, the Spat. Yeah, you could get like multiple diseases in DD1, which always led to like some weirdness. Unless, of course, you had the Crimson Curse. Pew! Pew, pew! Crimson curse. The thing that nobody likes. Apply to attacker when hit. Eh. This would be really good if I was... Uh, uh, I mean, it's it's got some value. Nah. It's good, it's good if I was, like, running a Tempest Leper. Um, it could be good for, like, a stun build with the Highwaymen to, like, get more... But we're already generating enough of it, honestly, so I don't really care that much. Alright, that was okay. For... That was fine. That was fine for a sluice. Of course, we have shit relationships now, so... That's a thing. <laughs> Sorry, guys. The table is set. Daredevil on Bate, the Yips on Swan, Vigilant, Combat Route Spatting, and Hazardous Route. That's pretty good. Um, the Yips ain't great. Our relationships are shit. Precious relics remind us of a time. But hey, we've got a songbook of touching Dirges. That could be good for us. Might get us slightly out of the gutter. Oh god, we got up to three. <laughs> Sixty-five percent chance of a negative relationship. Uh, five and five. Thirty-three, sixty-five. We're probably gonna get two. Probably gonna get two relationships. Oh well. Two negative relationships, I should say. Now let's see where we're going. We do have a shroud. Excellent. Um, Is there no sanctuary from this madness? Do I care about royal summons? 
Not really. Uh, but we care about fighting the Leviathan. Uh, he's already got 100% move resist, so I'm not worried about him. So these two are immobile now, so that should make this fight a lot easier. Now what do we want to get rid of? Oh my god, I keep hitting the wrong button, sorry. Resolute, Melophobic, Greedy. None of these are particularly terrible. Like, I'd love to get rid of Off Guard and the Hips, but that's going to be a bit harder to do. Um, Melophobic does block a lot, though, so. Relation shits. I'll go ahead and show myself the door. No, 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 no. Stay. It's fine. Oh, wow. Icebox now does plus one disease resist per food and inventory. And plus two quantity. That's honestly the food builds. The food build is like low key great. Like with the uh, with the rabbit. Because you get loads more health. You can stack food higher if you have the icebox. You can get more food with the icebox. Or with the, the food and barrels. You can get more food with the icebox. And then disease resist on top of that. That's pretty, it's pretty good. There's the new carriage lamps. Um, da, 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 da. Bear, do, 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 do. Plus two slime molds, slime molds, yeah. I mean, it doesn't. I mean, if slime mold, if every one gives me plus one disease resist, I'll stack it. Anyone would say that about a game where you go on murdering cosmic beings? Food builds are are real. They exist now. A bit of comfort on the road to damnation. Definitely a thing. Something to ease the rigors of the road. Um. Give ourselves as many buffs as I can get. Murdering cosmic beings after, like, a weapon. Yeah. I'd, I'd like to kill them first, and then I just want to have a nice snack. Nice little snacky snack. I mean, you have to have the energy in order to fight the baddies, right? So, like, that's... It's a, it's a valid point. Da, 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 da. Alright. Uh, I'm saying we're getting at least two. Hopefully we have less than two, but we'll see. Okay, two of these are negative. Yep. Each covets what the other has. God damn, ruin and open. God, fuck you, game. You're supposed to pick ones that are mastered. Oh, that's gonna fuck up my... Okay, that's fine. Oh, three. Oh, God. Narrowed eyes, muttered threats. Take aim. That's great. And bind. Oh, my God. Oh, uh, my poor cultist is fucked, bro. All right. Uh, okay. Oh, God. I also didn't. Okay, that's fine. My armor's fine. It's so whatever. I didn't repair the, uh... I didn't repair the stagecoach. I forgot. Okay, what did we switch out for? Pistol shot. Okay, nope. <laughs> that's fine. This switched out for... It's a weird demon's pull. I took off weakening curse. Okay, fine. Ruin switched off with stand, which we definitely need. Okay. Okay, I think we're fine. I mean, it's a punishment. You're not supposed to be able to swap them out. If you could swap them out, it would make it pretty negligible as a punishment. 
you just be like, whatever, I don't care. <laughs> All right, let's go left. Yeah. Man, the shroud, I will say what I love about the shroud and what I think they should do in other regions um, is you can see the bottom half of the fucking game. Like, every other region is so dark at the bottom that you can't see it. I like that you can. Yeah, again, I think I think that would be... The problem with that is it becomes too predictable. Like, you can you can then kind of negate it just by being like, oh, I just know that if I do this, if I put it in this slot, then this will always be the one that it picks. And um, that's just, yeah. It, it, the point is that you have to adapt to it. Yeah, it's still way better. Honestly, this is the worst relationship one I've had in a long time. I've, I normally don't even get more than one or two throughout a whole run. Hey, Kyrogen's table. This one's really good now. After each location, remove 10% temp ten chance to remove disease. That's going to be really helpful for us later. They've updated that. And then Fisherman's Gloves is going to be really good for us as well. Uh, if we have a serrated item equipped, which we don't. Um, but we can probably... Do we have anything that's serrated? I think this is... That's serrated, but I'm not putting that on my jester. Uh, but we'll take this for now. We'll leave that. <laughs> what people to yell? Start yelling at each other. Yell more. All right. So yeah, that will give us um, plus one bleed and more bleed piercing. Which is the new way they've got it to say that it just goes through bleed resist more effectively. Little easy pillager fight, nothing crazy. As the world collapses. The stress from that, or the the suspicious and stuff like that's gonna suck, but we'll, we'll be fine. We're just gonna have to crit a whole lot, okay? Or they can crit a whole lot. God damn. Uh, it like picked all of my like abilities that I really want to use. Holy crit sixteen! Are you fucking serious? Well, this is a rough start. Messy. Yeah, I'm just gonna double watchdog. Quadruple watchdog. Don't hit the jester. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Shroud chose violence, always chooses violence. Just need lots of crits. I like how, it, I don't know if you ever noticed this, but when you use that ability, it makes his head go flat for whatever reason. They falter, so press your advance. Mm -hmm. An inkling of potency still lingers. Some of these well uh, strong shackles may have some use. Um, on demons pull specifically, but I'm gonna leave it. The problem I have with strong shackles is just that it locks people where you want, where you don't want them to be locked. Like demons pull, it works well with when you can use demons pull. But if I use something else and I try to hit somebody, it's just gonna move them weirdly. That's good heals. Good heals. Alright, let's check our items, make sure that we're feeling okay. Otherworldly fragments is fine. Um, I don't think the two laudanum is going to do much for us, but having this way to negate the... Uh, having eight... Eight... Uh, 
Milk soak linen to negate the breath is going to be helpful for us. The change, an inglorious heap of rotting timbers. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. Thank you. Yeah, the double stun that these guys can do is always fun. Wait, what? What stressed him? What? He hit both of them. Why did he stress? Oh, all right. Okay, there's, there's Flower doing his job. Every time he resists that, he's just going to add more regen. So these guys are actually just going to heal the shit out of him. Fun. The enemy weakens and wanes. Oh, that's a rough fight. And they're elite, too. Oh, boy. Thankfully, well, it doesn't really matter, actually, because it doesn't matter the leper's going. They can't hit the front row anyway, so. Oh, okay. We're going to use one of these now. This mash, yeah. This is not a fun mash, for sure. Keepo will actually help us out, though. We'll regen, so that's good. Yeah, we have to pull one of these guys or attempt to pull one of them. I'm going to try to... Yeah, I know we're using stuff that we need for the Leviathan, but I would rather just kill these guys and get to the Leviathan in good health. Oh, that was a little glitchy. Good dodge. Good hit. Hey, Biggles, how's it going? Welcome on in. How you doing? Good dodge, good dodge. Does he have Daredevil? Ah, okay. He's Yeah, I remember, so I was like, somebody got Daredevil, didn't they? Yep. That's rough. Sword took a five-year-old hike. Yes, they had the hike go. Straightforward. Yeah, definitely worried about our uh, jester. Hold fast, for who knows what lurks in the beyond. Um. Yeah, this is not great. Jordan did time with my shoulders. Oof. I'm sorry, man. But hey, as long as you, as long as you had fun, right? That's that's what matters. A slow dissection. An come on, come on. Fucking hell, video game. All right. Sodden sweater is pretty good. Fisherman's line is fine. Busker's hall is fine. It's not great. Uh, we got the new... This is the new trophy, Lashing Tides. Uh, we didn't get the bleed one, which is the one that we wanted, but... Uh, increases combat stacking or I item stacking for combat items by two, which is good. It's it's very good. You can get some pretty crazy stacks of, like, things that you can hoard. It's better than the other one, or how it used to be, that's for sure. But I don't know how well we're going to do against this fight, if I'm honest. Well, if I'm honest, I don't think we're going to do very well against it at all. Da, 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 da. 
yeah, it's it's pretty sick. I'm glad they finally updated it. One second, just checking something. Yeah. All right. Spam those Leviathan emotes. Let's see if we can take on Big Fishy himself. Hey, friend, it's been a while. They must be made to see that their monstrous god is mortal. Infinite arm time. Never ending. Okay. Thankfully, you can't pull either of these two down. And that's only going to add regen to me, so. Come on, I need these I need these blinds to stick. Meltdowns are gonna happen. There's not much I can really do about that. Come on, game. You gotta do better than that. Eyes of the Storm on him is particularly bad. Death store check. And unfortunately, the hand can batter him. Oh my god. Clutch. Woo! Alright, that saved us. We're up to eight regen now. Honestly, not even that big a deal. Absolutely clutch. a clutch resolute. Dude, just like, nah, I'm not done yet, game. <laughs> that could have actually ended badly. That that heal I took instead of just whacking him uh, was a bad idea. The past is gone. 
Let it die. But hey, we'll take it. We'll take these things, and we'll be happy with them. The loathing abates. Uh, okay. Oh shit! Here we go again. Hey, Culber, how's it going? How's it going? So, sodden sweater could be pretty good on him. Um, basically, it allows him to heal whenever they get he gets bled. It allow him to stress heal every time he gets some move resist. Um, but is it better than clenching claws? Is it better than a simple flower? Like, how often are we going to be getting moved? That's the question, right? Bled, yes, but moved, yeah. Uh, Fisherman's line is great if we have something that can do anything with it, which right now we can't. Join the new update? Yeah, yeah. Really liking it. If we can get a serrated item on the Jester, this is actually a great combination, because he'll then do bleed from the serrated item, more bleed from this because of that, additional bleed from his bleed abilities, and then also uh, it just has a higher chance to stick. So that's a pretty good one if we can get that to happen. Probably a dumb move because clenching claws is so damn good, but this feels like the perfect poet combination. He's got 160% move resist. It's crazy. Yeah, with the way the trophies work now, like bleed actually like will stack properly like that, so it's pretty good. I don't have any healing items though. But we should get better road heals, so. Just gotta just gotta watch our stress now. I wish that we had gotten a road heal before we went into that, but hey, whatever. Compassion, quiet, hey, Raven. Change it so far? What are my thoughts? Uh, I really like it so far. Uh, I'm a big fan of how they've changed the, uh, the trinkets uh, to be for the dot trinkets to all work together properly now and actually synergize. That's really nice. Um, I think pets are a really fun addition. I like, I know a lot of people kind of wanted them to be more involved, but I'm actually glad they're not. I like that they're just kind of like a, like an overarching thing that just kind of slightly affects how you do the run and stuff. You can make them pretty powerful, but I don't, also am glad that they don't just like take over the run because that could be annoying. Uh, they trinkets the dot trinkets got like nerfed but not nerfed yeah i know that they don't do as much but now they all in like synergize with each other whereas before they only synergized with the move so if you get the right things um like trinkets now synergize with combat items and they synergize with each other whereas before they didn't they were like all separate things so um like this one right if serrated item is equipped three bleed this one is, if Serrated Eye is equipped, one bleed. Um, and more bleed resistance piercing. Like, these actually, like, the piercing now works with this, whereas before it didn't. Um, so th that's why they changed it, because they were too powerful with the way they, they changed it. So Some damage for some moves only. I think it works better this way. I think it's more, in like, makes more sense to me. Um... When I was, uh, th there's some broken like combinations you can get with them still, but yeah, I mean it's definitely like it's a it's a different way of doing it. Whether or not it's better or not, I think we just have to find out. But I think you can overall get more more damage from dot than you could before. What's the serrated? I, I don't have a serrated item equipped, unfortunately. I need to find one. Once I get one, my jester will be bleeding like a madman. Holy fucking crap, dude! Jesus Christ. You good? If you don't get to use the items, you end up with plus two blight versus plus four for the PD Noxious Blast. Yeah, I mean, it, if it doesn't, if you don't get the right items, it doesn't work as well. But I still think it, I still think it makes more sense, and I think it opens up for more combinations, which is what I care about when it comes to trinkets. I like the wacky combos, so for me, I think it, it, it feels better, but. I can understand like why it doesn't it's not as good in some cases. 
Relationships are still screwed on my team right now, but that's fine. Yeah, just crit everything all the time, always, and then we'll be fine. That was pretty good. They removed uh, anything. They changed all of them to be, like, plus... Um, they, they, like, they removed the, all the ones that, like, did, like, percentages, right? And just gave them a blanket increase, so it's plus three now instead of the percentage one. Again, because the way it works now, if you stack the trinkets right, if it was percentage based on Orphan, um, you could get like some ridiculous burns, like with the way that they were testing it. Um, I think the flat rate just, I think it makes more sense from like new players can understand it a bit better. Um, but yeah, it can, you can get some pretty crazy burns of it and stuff. It's just a matter of, like, the new system, I think, just allows for things to break a bit more. We'll have to see how it feels, though. This is a really good trinket. I could get this Dark Impulse to the Leper that make it so that he can never be bled, and then he just uh, heals for 10% every time. That may actually be better than this, because he's still got the move resist, right? The move, this, I actually think that's a better call. I think if I do this, and I do that, right? Now he can't be bled. He already can't be moved, right? So we lose out on the regen from the move resist, but bleed is way more common. And now every time somebody tries to bleed him, he's just going to heal 10%. So I think that's a better call. Healing of a cultist chance. For yeah, that's true. Just just bleed him. Bleed him, Jimmy. God, I cannot get any of them to agree, man. They, The occultist and the mana arms and the leper, like, just will not agree with one another. They just cannot. <laughs> the loathing whispers. All right, where are we going? Everybody wants to go to the academic study. Honestly, it doesn't really matter which way we go. This is going to be a barricade, barricade, which is fine. Right. Last night, PD and I were at zero for a long time. Oof. I'll be excited to see how this new, how this new combat item stacking trophy feels. Plus six crit from the barrel last in. Nice. That's nice. That's really nice, actually. The new patch has a lot more negative relationships. They've nerfed a lot of the... There's, like, a lot of items have been nerfed. Like, Whiskey Barrel got nerfed and stuff, and... Um, I think they're still, like, toying with, like, what the right balance is for, um... Like, what the right balance is for the game to make it. It's that relationships are not, like, super easy to just cheese while also, you know, not making them too difficult, so. The assistance encounters have been completely rehauled, so there's, like, a bit... God, six heal every time that happens. So, like, there's a lot... I don't know. It, it's just going to take some getting used to, I think. But, yeah, it's it's been changed pretty heavily. I should have blinded the cannon. Why did I blind the cannon? That was a dumb move. Oh, well. Pets other than the starter in, you can't. Nope, only at the starter in. So you have whatever your selection is there, that's what you gotta take. Dun, 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 dun. 
Easy cannon. I wish the cannon had like a special loot item you could get from it, like a rare drop. Would be nice. Venom drop half and it still feels mad the pros aren't worth. I love Venom drop. I think like if you can get her generating stealth and getting like six blight on two people at the same time, it's pretty powerful. I just find it a fun path to play. My thing about a lot of the paths is I don't really care that they're that, that good. I just care that they're fun. The spoils, an artifact of unparalleled power. Um. <laughs> Yeah, again, it's less hassle, but I find it's just, it's a little bit more boring. Like, and there's, for me, it's like, at this point, I'm at the point where I've, like, played where I'm like, I'd rather, like, have ones where I have, like, fun set up and I can get some wacky builds. Um, rather than just, like, point and click and it does, it does the thing. Comrade underscore karma says they say you miss 100% of an apple a day if you kill two birds with water under the bridge. I'd rather sink than swim in the hearts and minds of the grave men and women who serve our breakfast sausage links to the past. Jesus a bird Christ. in the what hand is worth a penny for your thoughts. The pen is mightier than the early bird if you can lead a horse to water. All right. Cool, cool. I have no idea what you just said, but I'll take it. I don't think we really even want Pocket Roach, man, like... <laughs> I want to go home! I'm tired, Grandpa! Well, that's too damn bad! Now, the only person it would work well on is the Leper, but, like, I don't really care about him going twice, per se, like... He's not really doing that much useful if he goes twice. I don't have this. I'll, I'll keep it for now because we have the space for it. And we might find some like stun resist stuff that helps us or something. Uh, and I don't want to just waste it, you know, but. Yeah, extra turn or stun. Yeah, 50% stun or 50% extra turn. It would be great on somebody like our Highwayman or our Jester, but they have really low stun resist and I'd rather not end up with them getting stunned all the time. And the Leper, I just don't think we get much action economy out of the Leper if he gets an extra turn. Like, he can intimidate again, which is useful, and he can get more taunt that way, but... It doesn't feel particularly great to me. What's he got that keeps dazing him? Off guard, great. Oh, yeah. Really, really good stuns there. Do better, video game item. Oh, dysentery. Nice. That's great. That's super helpful. Path is Leper, he's Poet. Better not be Tempest now, he's not Tempest. <laughs> Boom! Get fucking shot on, nerd. We are the flame, burning brightly for all the world. To burning see. brightly for all the world to see, he says. For all the world. Do 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 do
save themselves, they would slip beneath the brackish waters and be reborn in the image of their aquatic demiurge. They're away and losing words that I don't understand. Sandstorm remix. It's yeah, it's a slight buff for her damage, which I find interesting because I thought they were just going to like keep it the same. But she definitely seems to have gotten a little bit of a buff, which I'm not against. She definitely needed it. Um, which way do we want to go? I've got one loathing. This way is a hazard. Uh, into an assistance encounter, into a rough patch, into unknown. We'll take the middle route just because I want to show off the. We can show off the uh, the trap here. You guys ready? It's gonna be spooky. Here it comes. Okay. Yeah, she might fall. I mean, if everybody else gets a buff, right? They might just keep everybody else the same, but we'll have to see what it's like in 1.0. Yeah, the trap here is pretty cool. I like the traps. I'm, I'm glad they took the effort to, like, actually animate, like, different kinds of traps and not just, like... We just got tentacled? Yeah. Moving. We must keep moving. Nope. Rough patch. The baby tentacles on the road, yeah. Mama tentacle was not happy. Which makes me think there's a giant kraken out there. I mean, is that just like hanging out with the Leviathan? Like, what are they doing, you know? They just like, they just chilling together. The loathing festers. I mean, the Leviathan's dead, so it doesn't really matter that much, but. The loathing festers. Playing cards. He's got enough hands. Ah, I love the drift. <laughs> Skirt. He chatters incoherently, but his prices remain fixed. Oh, hello, nautical compass. Naughty, naughty, nautical compass. Also, mortar and pestle, which is another medical gear item, which would be useful for us. Um, can I see the stagecoach? I can. But we're going to drop that, and we're probably going to drop trinket organizer. I don't think we need trinket organizer anymore. I mean, it's nice. We might drop iron branded wheels, actually. And then we could put Kyrgyz's table and uh, and Poultice, Mortar and Pestle. I'm going to take that. Drop that. I'm going to drop that. And who wants Nautical Compass? Somebody does. I mean, it's probably better than Raven's Reach, honestly. Also, do you have a serrated item at all, perchance? Do we have another? Do we have a serrated item yet? We don't. We still don't have a serrated item. Game. Oh, we have pr I mean, pristine lore is a serrated item, but it's a trinket. I need a combat item that's serrated. My slime mold. Anything but my slime mold, please. Please, video game man, not my slime mold. Such power. In such a little thing. Peculiar Plods is great, but we're not really building him around his debuff ability. Uh, relationships. Something else I need to think about. Of comfort on the road to damnation. Da -da. Need to try to repair them somehow. The lore pet. Oh, God, you're right. Oh, I forgot about that combination. You're right, Alex. That's a really good combo. Um, I It's too late now, unfortunately. I forgot about that. That's like... Because it has the chance to bleed him. So he just gets a bunch of random, like, procs for... Uh, 
heal. Ah, oh well. I've had that before, and I remember it being just, like, absolutely busted. It was just like, oh, he's just never gonna die. <laughs> oh well. Next time. Development. Bro, use your dodge. And vexation. Bruh, come on. I had faith in you. <laughs> Proof that dodge only works to enemies. 100% factual. No cap. Not a single cap was had that day. <laughs> I believe in me that believes in you. The believe I believe in the the, the dodge. Do, do, do. The duck, the dip, dodge, dip, duck, and dive. You can dodge a bullet. You can dodge a bullet. What? What? Okay, Neo. Fuck. Sorry, I'm just making weird noises at this point. All right, let's go fight this Deacon. Deacon's good. Deacon's the better option of the fights. <laughs> Oh, no, not the horror. How do you think about the horror? Of stress right now on this team. I don't know where all of it came from, honestly. Early results are encouraging. I see Curse Coin on him. We'll be feeling pretty good. Oh, he had two. He had two. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> I need, I need to do this, maybe, Tay. Time for some habanero infused jelly beans, chat. Mmm, delicious. We'll do orange and lemon. Just immediately spicy. A simple kindness. Woo! Ow! <clears throat> oh. I'm glad that doesn't actually remove his stun or anything as well. That would be that would be no fun.
Fuck. No, he weaved his bones. Not the bones! Anything but the bones. This is no wow. Time to fall to that hurt. Oh my god, we're actually getting, like, good stun value out of the, uh... The occultist here. I feel like he's stunning from something else, though. Like, I didn't think he had two... He didn't have two unchecked power there, did he? Maybe he did, and I'm just crazy. We're in round four. That means he must have generated one every round? Because he's stunned twice? I'm just not paying enough attention, I guess. There is comfort in company. Thanks for the heal. Got him. He dead. Man, we're getting all the cultist trinkets today, huh? I don't think we take Temptation, honestly. Or Bulwark, man. Temptation's great, but... We don't need it. The loathing whispers. At last, respite within reach. What do we get? It is safe here. Fanatic Slayer, Austere, and Bum Leg. Even with Bum Leg, still has 120% move resist. Um, do we care about the. I'm gonna take it, but do I care about this on the Jester? Am I gonna actually use it? Probably not. We can get a serrated item at least. Serrated item, please? Hey, look, there's a serrated item. Um, all right, let's take a look at the Wayne right here. Your coach must be maintained if it is to carry you where you must go. Experimentation. Your academic instinct. This is all medical gear now, so we're getting an additional 20% healing received from medical gear on top of the 20% traveling heal from this. Uh, 20%. This is healing received from skills, so. You know, it's really only affecting uh, <laughs> weird reconstruction. But like, when he heals, he's gonna heal for fat stacks of healing. One so quickly when survival demands it. Solemnity is also gonna heal for well, already healing for a ridiculous amount. So now to heal for a more ridiculous amount. All right, we need to switch out our abilities here because we got messed up with them last time. Okay. So I forgot your morning shake. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Shake that booty. Kind of bad, but then I realized it's a stained item. Yep. That unlocks the potential for cultist trinkets, i.e. it lets you um, use... You can use two cultist trinkets on the same person if you wanted to. 
Shake, shake your beat. Yeah, okay. That's good. That's funny. That's, that's a funny one. That's good. I like that. Yeah, if you get enough cultist trinkets, it's indeed nutty. But the thing is, you have to find the cultist trinkets, which... That's the hard part. <laughs> the hard part is getting the the items that you need. Rain, fire, and rot. Is there no sanctuary from this madness? Sanctuary! The farms and fields of our kingdom overrun with putrescence and rot. Just find the cultist trinkets. Easy. It's easy. Just always crit and always dodge. That was really not the one we needed to get hit there. Okay, applesauce and bate. Fucking goddamn. Are you serious? Come on. Okay, that was good. That We got that back up. Now it's only a 28% chance instead of what it was before. Ugh. Nothing else that can help relationships. We're really just getting shafted on the relationship department. I'm taking these and putting them on our jester. Pipe weed. I don't see any pipe weed. Oh, I've got pipe weed. Thank you. Thanks to the Lord Raven. Appreciate it. Is there any, though, that this is actually going to do anything on? Not really. Unless we roll a crit on these two. Which we did not. Yeah. Not feeling particularly good here. 28% chance, 28% chance. We've got two that are going to be... Yeah, two that are going to be pretty high risk. Some that might give us positives, but unlikely. And you can't really afford anything else, so. We have laudanum on somebody? We do. I'll just take more laudanum. Because why not? We can stack these things higher as well if we get more things to stack. Alright. I don't need the slime mold, though. <laughs> If I had the food build, maybe. Okay, one negative. Oh, no, it's one positive. Okay, we got lucky. While the heart still beats, desire will never die. No more hatred. Yeah, everybody's cool. Everybody's, everybody's good now. We're good. Nah, 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 nah. All right, guys, time for some feeder, foder, fajita. Ooh, now I want a fajita. Fajita sounds pretty dope. And abhorrent. Guys, they grow unchecked and abhorrent. Isn't that crazy? It's crazy how they grow up unchecked and abhorrent. Do we have any hospitals? There's no hospitals in this region, are there? Unless there's a modifier, you're not going to get a hospital here. Well, all right. Well, we have a 10% chance to remove this every time. Now you maybe want a fajita. Fajita sounds fucking dope right now, doesn't it? Done it? I kind of want to avoid um, taking the armor hit because then we lose the block tokens thingy, especially right before the creature den, and then we hit another armor one, and then we're down to two armor for already a long ass region. So God, I'm already. I do love this because like, I love that I'm like already like okay, I probably can't. I shouldn't go that way. If I go this way, then I think we avoid most of the issues. Then we can kind of go up this way. Yeah. Okay. There's definitely a more tactical feeling to driving now. When is Fajita not a good idea? I have no idea. Though I probably, like, I'd have to go. I would ra I'd rather not order a Fajita. Like, I'd want to go somewhere to get a Fajita. Because you want it, like, coming out, like, all sizzling and fresh. Like, if you order a fajita, I feel like it's just going to show up, like, all soggy and, you know, it's going to be steamed in the bag and I ain't gonna, it ain't going to be particularly good, you know? 
Yeah, you need the sizzles. Which I found out are a lie, by the way. They just put a little bit of water in the hot plate, and that's what makes the sizzles. Not that it's, like, fresh off the stove. God. Or the, you know, the pan or whatever the fuck. The skillet. This is news to me. I mean, I'm sure some places they do it like where it's like super duper fresh, but no, it's that uh, six bleed there. That's nice. But like I've worked at restaurants and yeah, they generally it's like they just pour a little bit of water onto like the really hot, like, um, like cast iron plate that they serve it on and call that a day. And then what they tell you to do is they'll have you take the longest path possible to the table. And the reason they do that is because that sizzle and like the smell and stuff and tight, like it's a really good like price item. Like people pay a lot of money for a fajita, but it's like pretty cheap because it's just a bunch of vegetables and some sliced meat. And so what they'll do is they have you like, hey, if you got the fajita, go take it around as many tables as possible because then people are like, ooh, I want that. And they get the best like cost return on it. Bravo. Everything is psychology. But I do want that. I know, like, damn it. I'm being manipulated, but I don't care. I still want it. <laughs> Feels much better about all the negative relationships. Until the next test is put before you. I don't know why I keep getting these emails. I get emails from the California Attorney General for some reason. They're just like, you know, updates about laws and stuff. I don't know what I signed up for they gave that to me, but every time I get the email, I freak out a little bit because I'm like, oh God, like why is the attorney jet, like California attorney general's office emailing me? <laughs> like, am I in trouble? Like, no, it's just like a newsletter. And every time I try to unsubscribe from it, it just get resubscribed. They revel in debauchery. Debasing themselves in the face of the end. The face of the end. No, don't, no, 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 no. Double lady. Hastened double lady. No, I don't want it. <laughs> what? I like how that it was a positive pin. It's like, hey, by the way, I'm going to make sure that they hit you all the time. And he was like, yeah, that's cool. Don't worry about it. Thanks, bro. Like, I appreciate that. Thank you. Eight, yeah, if you get it right, we can get eight, uh, eight bleed on that, which is pretty, pretty gnarly, bro. Compassion quiets the howling mind. Steady yourself. Ow. Wow. Jester's already feeling the, uh, the love here. Oh, God, this is not good. All right, occultist. Fellowship yeah. forged through toil. That's pretty good. Mistimed, misdirected. The problem with ladies is they like ignore all the taunt that we're like putting up because they just they they just hit the spots that they care about. Like they don't hit any other spot. An actual useful weird heal. Helps that we have plus 20% healing because of the, uh... Because of the, um... The Pliskin. So, when he does hit, it's gonna scale pretty well. Yeah, just another AoE stress hit. That's great. That's fair.
Oh god, it still hurts. It still really hurts. That's a lot of damage. Mmm, sepsis. Sepsis don't give a fuck. Brilliant brew. The loathing abates. It's abating. It's abating. Guys, it abated. It abated. We got plenty more fights coming, so let's just let's just take the one that we know what it is. Oh, plus this is a good. Oh wait, uh, was that was a stress increase, not decrease. I misread that. The worst kind of parasite. Opportunists. Opportunists. Hey guys, do you guys just want to not fight? We just want to like, just want to hang out. Is that cool? Can we do that instead? Why did that stress you? Oh, nautical, nautical compass. I gotta remember, nautical compass is a thing. Such a nice quality of life change. It is. It takes a little bit of while to get like used to it doing that, but it is very nice. Especially like if you're just playing kind of casually and you're just like da 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 da. Like you're not really like you know. It's like oh, can I please? <laughs> the bleed resist is great. Agony by accumulation. Shit! Shit balls! Guys, we fucked up! A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. Fuck. This team is not... We're struggling right now. I'm not I'm gonna lie. We are... Uh, we're on the struggle bus a little bit. My inability to heal is definitely uh, causing some problems. <laughs> Dragged back from the brink. Woo! When it scales, it scales! <laughs> I'll take a 44, <laughs> a 44 weird reconstruction. Yeah, please. That's, that's good for me. Uh, he's just burning the shit out of himself. Who's back there like, what if I just set myself on fire more? Would that be good? Can you do that to yourself? It's gonna be a crit heal too. Crit 10? Yeah, that's great. A small reprieve from this carousel of horrors. I mean, it's working. Like, weird is working. But the additional 20% heal, you know, as long... Like, it scales kind of weird. So that was probably like, I don't know, like a 5 or... Or probably like a 6 heal and it gave to a 10. But when it heals for like 15, it's going to heal for like crazy large, right? Because of the way it scales, so... Definitely, it's definitely a an interesting way to heal. Now I just need the the Kyrgyz table to actually remove disease randomly. It's a ten percent chance from every location, so I see that the proc once, please, at some point. That'd be great. All right. Um. I mean, either way, it's resistance encounter, resistance encounter. This is a safe road.
or not no it was there was a, an oblivion tear on this one on that road and it like caused the camera to freak out <laughs> Okay, two people want to leave, and you know what? I'm going to agree. I'm sure taking fights is a good idea, but... Um, okay. Where do we want to go? Let's go to the one on the right. How many teeth you guys have? They got... The answer is yes to that question. Perhaps you are finding your courage at last. Oblivion Terror? Yep. See, it's always the jester. All of them. Yeah. Yeah. How many teeth do you guys have? Yes. What? Yes. They're like sharks. They just keep growing them, you know? Never ending. Fight. Fight. We leave. We'll fight. We'll fight so that others may flee. It's probably going to be like double dinner cart. Oh, that's not much better. In fact, it's worse. It's probably worse. It's, pro it's definitely... Yeah, it's worse. Black Phillip going to cause us some problems here. Oh, and we're dazed too. Thankfully, though, he won't be able to move my ass, so I'll just stress heal from this. Yeah, keep doing that. That's fine. A master stroke. Hello, Philip. Hello, Philip. Goodbye, Philip. God, I need you to dodge something for once in your pathetic life, Dismas. Kidding. You don't, I, I don't need to be so rude. Babylon. He's, sometimes he says some pretty wild shit. You're like, wait, what the fuck? <laughs> I do love when the uh, the Hellion does that, though, where she's just like... <laughs> like, bro, what the fuck are you saying? Twelve bleed. Don't mind if I do. Thank you very much. He's probably gonna eat that corpse though. I don't really have an effective way to remove it. Besides, you know, shooting him. But we could also just put him on that store. That's a valid way. I mean I have Demon's Pull, I guess, which Which does do the thing. <laughs> I'm really loving this update. These are both good, but not using them. I'm having a lot of fun with this update. It's nice, refreshing. I'm so excited for 1.0. Like, with the amount of content that's going to drop with that, it's going to be so much. Like, it's going to be daunting because I got to make videos and, like, get content out and stuff. But it's going to be, like, so nice to just see the game fully done, finally. Time to drift. Oh! It kind of makes sense. They're like the frontline soldiers, right? They're the ones who are just like they actually have really low uh, death store. Um, but like, you know, they're supposed to be they're supposed to soak up all the damage, right? Like, that's the point is that they're supposed to like especially with the drummer. Oh, thanks for the almanac. I really appreciate it in this region. Like, the idea is that like, you know, they they get taunts they negate all the damage that you're trying to do they soak it up with block tokens and then they're hard to kill on top of that so they're frustrating they're frustrating enemies but like in a good way sometimes oh that's the new uh that's the hazard in this area they just set a bunch of pestilent bugs to come fuck your day up
Yeah, I don't know. 15 torchlight for many relics. Fuck it. Plenty of food that remain. Yeah, but it's all gross food, right? We did, yeah, for this update, it's, I think it's warranted, yeah. This this update has been a lot of fun. They've def they're definitely listening to people and like, you know. And I will say like, at, at, being that I'm a play tester, like they take into account so much more feedback than I think people know they do. And that they don't really share just cause like, you know, it's, they just, they listen to everything, it's crazy. I did support. I did submit a party comp name, but it, none of them got in. I didn't really have any creative ones. I need the torchlight. The, loathing best the only one I really liked was I had one that was like, I can't remember exactly what it was. I think it was like Runaway, um, Vestal, Plague Doctor, Occultist, and I called it like Hellfire, and it was like all heroes that could burn. But somebody got a different version of the same kind of set of them and I think they um they went with that instead which is fine I'm not super creative when it comes to this stuff um this one we don't know what it is it could be a rough patch this one we know is armor and we can most I want to try to avoid getting a urgent repair fight but we'll see god furry you're really stressed out Chaos must be met with, with unwavering resolve, resolve. Bugs! Not the bugs! <laughs> Rain upon the roof, nothing more. Bro, that was bugs. Where's Buttspot anyway? I don't know. Buttspot sometimes just seems to take a day off. Sometimes it works. Sometimes it's delayed. It's probably down. I don't know. It just is that way sometimes. Just do be that way sometimes. You know? Me? Stressed? Checks out. Valid. Uh, this isn't terrible, but Hastened is annoying. The slow suffering begins. Yeah, the issue with the Hasten is that it's just gonna... Cause a bunch of uh, bullshittery. There we go. The butchers will heal him up. Didn't persist between regions. I was so sad. Yeah, that used to, but it doesn't anymore. They only they only love each other for so long. Oh, that actually stressed me out. Cool. I'm glad that my double crit stressed you out. And because of the nautical compass. That procs, but. Nice crit heal, I guess. Dodge it, dodge it, dodge it! Furry, bro. I need you to. Come on. Gotta get your shit together here. Come on! Each of those have like a 50% chance of procking. Agony. And not, they're not doing it. Game, you gotta do better than that. Just a small, just just a teensy weensy meltdown. Just teensy weensy. Itsy bitsy teeny weeny itty bitty meltdown. Nautical compass is causing us some problems. It's giving us more stress than anything else, it seems. It's only a one in five chance to give us stress, too. I'm out of coffee. I'm sad. The loathing whispers. Uh, 
Oh, where we go? Where we go? We go forward. What is it? It's a cash. Okay. Oh, thanks for the one heal. <laughs> the worst kind of parasite. Opportunity. We have an exemplar, like right after this fight, by the way. Jesus Christ, Nautical Compass. One in five percent, or one in five chance of that happening. It's doing it like every fucking turn. Finally, eesh. Now, do a double crit and heal some stress. Thank you. I love how that just heals us. It's, it's so funny. Jester. Flathead. Did you guys see the flathead? When he uses harvest, he gets a flathead. God damn it. That must have been like a one <laughs> for us to get that. Stress heal? Stress heal? Fuck. Dead. Greater threats await those who dare. Yeah, well, we're about to hit a real great threat. I don't really have a great counter to it. This is going to be a rough exemplar. We we have a very high chance of dying to this exemplar. I'm not going to I'm not going to lie. How's the darkest dungeoning? It is dark and full of dungeons. How's it going, Burger? Welcome on in. Uh, thank you for the another shroud almanac that I've already used once. So I don't need it again. But thanks, I guess, I suppose. The right has the run so far? It's been good. It's uh, It's been a little rough, but we've made it this far. Now we just need to not die to the exemplar, which, again, is much easier said than done. Um. So, hope we get some good road heals here. We do have a rough patch. We should. I don't think we. Well, it's better. If this is a. Well, that shouldn't be a rough patch. I felt that. <laughs> Coach limping. Be prudent. Okay. If you kill it before you die, you should be. Okay, thanks. Yeah, you're valid. You're right. All right. A parody of human outline. It must be destroyed. Yeah, the table didn't get rid of any of our disease. I like how they were like, oh, yeah, by the way, we got rid of double turns like completely now. And it's like, doesn't matter because <laughs> just put the altar between the two turns. So it's like, we're still going to do the same thing. It's just going to be a slightly different way of doing it. Fucking God damn it. That's fine. Cool, 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 cool. Who or how the exemplar is created. What I love about him is the small detail that there's like a portal under him. And he's his body is literally 
Like, you can't see it because it's a 3D model and you can't see the back, but it's literally like a tail that's, like, going into the portal. So there's, like, this implication that there's, like, a lot more to him than you can see, um, which I find is pretty, pretty cool. Ten bleed off the bat is not bad. We'll take that. He sacrificed him. Early results are encouraging. We're still doing more. Uh, I'm gonna use one of my serrated items just to stack more bleed. I don't want to take the hit though. Um, on him, the leper has to eat these reposts because. Expecting enemies? Uh, no, you can't. Not one enemy. Not with enemies. Are you fucking high, bro? Holy shit! Jesus Christ, that was a lot. We're not doing great right now. A master stroke. Okay, there's six bleed. Did he take the damage for him? I've honestly only seen that a few times, so I don't actually know what just happened, but I assume he took the damage for him. There we go. See, that's that's what I need to have happen. At least the bleed healed him for more. That's funny. Uh, I cannot risk... Uh, I can't risk the damage from that. Jesus, this is not good. I mean, I think we'll be okay, but we've gotten some really nasty hits from this. Oh my god, come on, occultist. How did he is no time to Well, that's game. He's dead. Very lucky. The foothold out of this mire. Now climb. Come on. That's death door. Who's he gonna hit though? Probably the jester. Nope. That's fine. Agony. By it's okay. Bro, holy crap, we're getting absolutely shafted with those. A slow dissection, an unavoidable end. The okay. unrelenting application of violence yields morbid gain. Um, okay. Oh, I can't. That's great. 
Live by the weird, die by the weird. Oh my god. <laughs> what? What? Why? God, I know weird reconstruction is a meme, but it's like too much of a meme sometimes. <laughs> Uh, zero relationship now because of that. Fuck no. Yeah, and he's gonna crit both of them, which is a death door there. With a bleed. What's your death door resist right now? 72%? Fucking hell. I think we're gonna lose somebody here. Yep. I have no way to heal that. What is he down to? 62? Yeah. Self -reliance ah, game! Come on, bro! Additional 20% healing! Why is it not scaling, like, at all? We're rolling nothing but low. To be rolling fours, we have to be rolling like ones and twos consistently. That had to be a one. Like, this is ridiculous. An interminable conflict. Well, that's game. That's a coin flip now. Bye bye. Oh my god, he lived. There we go. Jesus Christ. All right, Jester. Come on. Fucking hell. Wow, that was bad. That was so many bad rolls. Like, I'm talking like those all had to be like rolling ones to twos for that to consistently happen. We're not taking idle thought. Um, four royal summons. Fudge, man. I gotta stop swearing so much. My video's gonna get demonetized. Oh my god, that was so bad. Oh, I mean, we survived, so there's that, I guess. Just, I just can't believe we we're plus 20% healing received from skills. We still managed to get, like, twos and fours for, like, four or five heals in a row. Like, even if he rolled a five, it would be, like, an eight or a nine or something, you know? Like, enough to be a significant heal. Rest now. Yeah, the fact that we got an evangelist as his his summon there was definitely not not good for us. Yeah, well that's what I'm saying, like it scales, right? So we just got very unlucky that we were rolling like below like fives consistently. When the range naturally is what? Zero to 50% heal, so... Yeah, it's gonna do less on, like, weaker enemies, or weaker heroes, I guess, so... It is what it is. Oh, he's austere, so he can't do that, I guess. We'll make Leper quick. Quick Leper. Um, okay. <laughs> we don't need to worry about his bleed resist. Definitely worried about his bleed resist more, so... Um... Listen. All right. Practice. Improve. A bit of comfort on the road to damnation. We have one that's a two, so like, there's no way 
This one is like guaranteed to be negative. Like there's nothing we can really do about that, but we can get this one out of the negative, furry and bate. So that was a plus two, so that was really good. I got them out of the negative. That's 5% base, it's fine. So what is it? Apple and furry are fucking hating each other. We can try to get them up a little bit, but it's not gonna do much for us. Drop that. Just hate everyone apparently. You're not you're definitely not feeling the friendliest right now, but I mean you you really like Swan. You're just indifferent to Pate. You just fucking hate Apple Slap Apple Slapple. Yeah, those stack up higher. Conventional fair. Thing is, we can stack these grenades really high, which is nice. So we can we get a pretty good like starting set of things because we can stack items higher. So we're just gonna like mow through whatever we can to get to the boss. To be fair, I hate everybody. Valid. Valid based opinion. Do 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 do. Coach must be maintained if it is to carry you where you must go. There's no hazards on the the mountain, so getting that repaired is actually pretty useful for us. Don't really care about any of these. Um, yeah, I think we just go. There is nothing for it now but to press on. Come what may. Uh, do you have any stitching kits? I can't afford them, right? No. All right. Okay. Aspiration, you this one's definitely the negative one, right? Oh my god, we didn't actually roll the negative. Tested. Woo! To be counted on. Um, great. All right, let me get the prediction up. By the way, let me do that. Ba -da 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 -da. Uh, one sec. I'm gonna update the prediction. Because I think having uh, it separated by... Get rid of that one. And that one. Just updating this. Alright. There we go. We're up against Act 2. Lungs. So. God, I love the mountain now. It looks so good, dude. At least we're getting some good heals on the road. Just basically fully healed there, which is great. Believers, prage, prage. God, the and like the off guard and the yips combined together, just coming in super clutch. 
measured and steady. We're powering through. Like, I'm not gonna hold my items back. Eight damage there. Lurky lurk. All right, Willie. How you doing, man? Hope you're doing good. Yep, that one's dead now. Good miss. Thank you. Get the double hit here. Nice. 11 damage. That's really good. Yeah, giving him all the crit tokens isn't particularly great, but... Four. Okay, so he's dead. We have a lot of dodge. Should be fine. Now we just start stacking the bleed. Up to 11 already. Yeah, it's gonna crit, but, you know, crit 6 is much better than a crit 24. I'll take it. Just equip highway robbery? We have highway robbery. Just steal them. We'll just take them all. We'll just yoink them. Like, bro, you don't need those. But I already have one, so I'm not worried about it. Persistence will overcome even the greatest of threats. Klepto Reynold strategy, well, yeah, you know, with the tokens, yeah. Basically, he's just Reynold with uh, with tokens. He just steals them all. All right. Uh, has everybody still got items on them? They should. One of each is fine. Reality comes asunder before our eyes. Take the vulnerable. <laughs> They're down to one. They have no relationship. Good thing it doesn't make a fucking difference. Wow, the leper rolled really quick there, which is nice to see. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. Mm, probably should have just gone for the crits. He's, he's gonna heal up a lot of that real, real big and in a hurry. Crit red on Dismas. Christmas. Agony. I think it's dead. Should be dead. Is killing Young's viable yet? Uh, what do you mean? Is it, like, viable in general or viable with this team? Like, with this team, it's definitely viable. The lungs are much easier to fight than they were originally when the game, when they first dropped. Probably should have gone for the stun, actually. Would have been the better option there. Because no right now, yeah, now we're feeling... Now we're feeling it. You feel it now, Mr. Krabs? Let's go for the stun. A master stroke. Oh, yeah, I mean, killing both lungs is definitely not the greatest strategy. You spend too much time putting damage into them and... Uh, not the middle, you're just gonna end up getting hit too hard by the... It just goes into, like, AoE mode and it starts cleaving everything. Try 
Drop exposing my inside to even avoid. Thanks. You just could you just could you just stop that? That'd be great. I don't think it can do um incremental. I think it can do it's No, it can do yawning void from everywhere. Okay. But that does force rush judgment, which is good. The AoE cleaves, I mean, it just really starts to stack the damage very quickly. Of course, that survived. Let's see if we can get some good heals. 19, I will take. So we're gonna stun. Yep. Definitely not in the best shape for this next fight. I'm hoping we can get at least the heals we need via via the road. We'll try to get another decent weird in here. Nine is good. It's a good chunk of health. All right, boss fight. Let's go. May the power of God and anime bless you. I got the power of God and anime on my side. <laughs> they definitely increase the length of the mountain. I think that definitely gives you way more chances to get some heals in. So, like, that pretty much fully healed us. Behold, the source of the stain. Gateway to incomprehensible. Emptiness. You know what I didn't do? <laughs> I didn't check my combat items. Whoopsie daisy. The seething sigh. Stirter's avatar. Of What's my favorite animal? You mean animal? My favorite animal is a snow leopard. I think they're fucking dope. Anime? Uh, favorite anime. Eesh. I don't know. I like a lot of animes, but I don't know what my favorite is. Bravo. I don't know. Oh, that's one health away. We're probably going to miss this. Intimidate. Yep. So now I got to do something stupid like... Uh, fucking this bullshit there's nothing yeah i have to do this it's unfortunate oh wow we blinded the lungs that was super useful i don't even know why you can get blind on them i guess you can just get any debuff on them like that's kind of the Good crit. Oh, we got the stun too. Even freaking better, bro. Powered 
emboldened. Okay. Didn't even stun the lung? I know. How fucking dare I not stun the lung? The double vulnerable is super good at helping us with that block, by the way. Like, stacking the vulnerable just helps negate the block so, so well. Sixteen damage. Fifty six healing. Were you trying to do damage to me, bud? Like, what's going on? Ah, we didn't get the vulnerable there. That's unfortunate. Dodge it. I said, dodge it. Uh, that puts us in a more in a more precarious situation. Bro, fucking dodge, bro. Well, this fight just turned around a little bit. A little bit more than I'd like it to. <sighs> not even I'm not even gonna comment on that. That's just that's just that's just Occultist. He just doing occultist things. God damn it, the blind. Now he's got double vulnerable. I'd like to use either highway robbery or something on that, but I can't. Or double vulnerable, double fucking block. Classic occultist, just doing classic occultist things. And I'm missing everything because of the blind, so I'm not even able to like... There we go. Easy mode act two or lung never deep breaths, yeah. What is it then? That case is we're we're now at the point where he can, so we're definitely gonna have to be cautious. Big bleed. Uh eh, six is fine. Let's have him for eight. Yeah, leper I don't think has landed more than like one bash so far. So far getting very lucky with these breaths. Hmm, that was just shy of what I need. The leper is not blind, though, so we should theoretically be able to this road be land a uh, land a hit here. There we go. Just resolute. Be easy. Okay. We did resolute. I could have stress healed in there and stopped that from happening. Potentially. But. We have another solemnity. We should be fine. I think we have another solemnity. We have another solemnity, right? Yeah. Easy. There we go. That's the hit I was looking for. Bro, your resist is not that high. It's only 30%. Like, come on. Okay, at least we got the bleed there. Dodge. That blind on him is rough. That's, that's bad. 
And our first deep breath right on the blind. Really helpful there. We could be in trouble here. Okay, we're in less trouble. Okay, we're fine. That's okay. Never punished. Ignore the deep breath, and we're just gonna damage in where we can. Okay. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. I love that animation, the one where it like spins around like that. Okay. Now just die. Just die in one hit. Okay. See? The thing is, if you just never get punished, then the game is easy. Ugh. Rigged. Hmm. All right. Prediction. Choose outcome. Full clear. No deaths. GG's. 